Okay, today I'm going to show you how to make um, test tiles for testing different glazes. The end result looks something like this. You want to keep them about as thick as you normally would a pot, and you're really only going to glaze the test tile till about there in uh, varying <coughs> thicknesses. So you want to dip it all the way down once, dip it down to about there a second time, and dip it at the top a third time. So you get really thick, moderately thick, and the thinnest. So, but that's about what I'm going to show you, how to throw them on the wheel. Um, so let's get going. So I'm just going to start out by flattening it out, getting it centered. And then I'm going to drop a hole all the way down the middle, all the way to the bat, and then pull out from there, pulling all the way to the side of the, the outside of the bat there. Keeping pressure on the top and on the sides so that it doesn't come out of center. Because you want this to be basically just like a a pot you would throw, so that the glazes absorb the same as they would on a pot that you'd actually want to keep. So just use this to clean out the inside, because there's no reason to have any any clay there. Just keep it a little bit cleaner. <clears throat> Also trying to keep the clay off the edge of the the bat over here. Okay. So we're gonna pinch and pull up, leaving this little foot here on the side. We're gonna pinch and pull up a couple of times. Keeping more pressure with the outside hand to keep it kind of coming at it in a cone shape so that it doesn't flare out and flop over. We'll straighten it up before we finish. And just one more time. You can see it's wanting to flare out even with me trying not to let it. Okay. okay. And down here on the bottom, we're just going to drop our finger down into the make a little groove here. This will just help counterbalance it just so it doesn't fall over in the kiln. You hate for, for one of them to topple over if you're testing glazes alongside a regular firing. Okay. Now we're just going to clean it up a little bit. Put some grooves into it so that we can see how the glazes pull and break over the edges of them. Let's clean up the inside a little bit. And clean up this edge here. I'm just going to take this knife and put some grooves into the side here. So that we can see how it breaks. And how the glaze breaks.
Just clean that up a bit, clean up the water. And then we're going to cut it off the, the bat. Once this gets leather hard, I'm going to come back with the knife and cut out. Just go through and cut, cut out each test tile so that they're roughly the same size. And hopefully I get a, a good number of them of that. So once again, let's say you throw these little test tiles. And then we put a little hole in them using that same knife when they're leather hard as well so that you could hang them up on a rope or put them on a nail on the wall so you could see them. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below. Have a great day.